everybody's entitled to their own opinion but give the guy some brownie points for even considering doing his own take to a song that's so freaking iconic and and most people wouldn't even dare to touch And welcome back to my channel. My name is Daya, and today I'm gonna to be reacting to Hanju from ATs. Ah, oh, ATs as leader has decided to do a cover to a masterpiece of a song. Freaking David Bowie. So excited. This is Space Oddity. Let's get it. Oh, I love how they're playing Space Oddity music video in the background. Oh, this is so dope. It definitely sounds very different. Ooh. Ooh, so this is like his own version of this. Oh my god, this is so dope. Hoju looks so cute as a blonde. Lift off. This is ground control to major tone. Oh my god, I got good fun. Look at that. And the papers want to know who shirts red. This is a major tone to ground control. I'm stepping through the door and I'm falling in a most peculiar way. Oh my god. <laughs> so cute! Stop! He's been coming after me like so bad. It's ridiculous. I'm like, I'll need to stop. Like, stop it, boo. I already have my bias. Guys, I'm so happy. This was so damn good. First of all, I do want to apologize because there might have been some background noise. Um, we're doing some renovations in the house and they're kind of like fixing a bunch of stuff. So sorry about that. But yeah, guys, this was absolutely amazing. Personally, I absolutely loved it. Like I'm a huge David Bowie fan and I know that no one will ever compare to Bowie or like be any better than or whatever the F. But I will say that I really do appreciate like this whole take that he had for this song. It definitely gave it a different vibe that I absolutely appreciate. I think the one thing that I absolutely appreciate is the fact that some of my favorite K-pop artists are doing these covers to all these iconic masterpieces. And it's not so much that they're doing these covers, it's, it's the fact that they're kind of introducing these old school artists to kids that probably have never even been exposed to them. Like these are artists that kind of like paved the way to everybody else that's been making music nowadays. I know for a fact and it's so so sad to say that they, there are kids nowadays that have never been exposed to the Beatles, have never been exposed to David Bowie, have never been exposed to like so many different artists out there that that are just so damn amazing. They, they were so so incredible and so huge back in their time and they have music that is just constantly playing in our days and 
kids have no idea who they are. You know, they'll listen to it. They'll be like, oh, I know this song. Like, I, I don't understand why I know the lyrics, but I don't know who sings it. And I'm just like, how? <laughs> but then I see Hong Jung and I see like Rose and I see like so many different people that, you know, have these old school artists in their playlists and are constantly being uh, inspired by them and doing their own little covers, doing their own takes on it. And it truly is like, it's, it's the best. Like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. I'm just so excited. Going back to the song, I do want to say that another thing that I absolutely adore, like entirely, is the fact that it's very risky and I feel like Hong Joon might have been extremely ballsy to do his own kind of twist to the sound and like switch it up a bit and then add his own lyrics, add his own like touch, you know? And the thing is, obviously you're gonna have people that absolutely love it and obviously you're gonna have people that don't like it and that's okay everybody's entitled to their own opinion but give the guy some brownie points for even considering doing his own take to a song that's so freaking iconic and and most people wouldn't even dare to touch this to me tells me that Hong Joon is not only an amazing leader he is extremely creative he you know he's inspired by so much and and he's not afraid of taking risks and I and I absolutely appreciate that when it comes to me music that's that's what makes an artist extremely successful i don't know like i absolutely love this and i definitely want to hear your opinions to this personally i just feel like this was such a treat and i like i'm i'm so incredibly happy like i really feel so much love right now hanjung looks so so damn good so cute i can't i can't he's just so adorable i want to stick him in my pocket because he's just so like <laughs> I guess the last thing that I wanted to say was a thank you to Hong Jung for even like covering such a beautiful song. Like I, I just, this was so amazing. It was, it was very beautiful. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can get notified on all my upcoming reaction videos. And I will see you guys on the next one. Also, if you guys have a video that you guys want me to check out to react to, just leave it in the comments below. I will see you guys on my next video. Much love.